What's up, my guy? How are you, Max? Yeah, good, man. How are you? Don't leave me hanging. Sorry. Yeah, we're all good. What's going on? We are gonna try and build a van in a day. Tried this before, failed. This is the third attempt. <laughs> we actually cheated. Do you wanna come have a look? Yeah, come on. Um, yeah. Whoa. Wow! This was a 2008 van that was offered to us by this like local person who knew about us and was like, oh, I got a cool old van, one owner from you, and was like, do you want it? And we kind of didn't, and then I had a look at it and I was like, yeah, we do. Um, and I've been writing about it in Volkswagen Bus Magazine for the last few issues. And it's cool because it's just really basic. They don't make them like this anymore. She is. <gasps> hey! Is this exciting? Look how much Remy loves it. You're addicted to this out. Right here. <laughs> she loves it. Absolutely loves it. How did you get here? How did you get here? Oh, 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 right in the kisser. Where were we? Uh, van. Van, crude van, uh, ultimately crude old van. Um, it looks exactly like mine. Very, Spec-wise. Very similar to yours. That's why they're what good. Year, what year is this? 2007, 2008. Oh, okay. So it's like 1.9 TDI, short wheelbase, cool color. Just like pretty. I reckon it'll be a bit of an iconic one. A, a part of the transporter story. Okay, okay. And this is one of them. And I needed a van. I haven't got a van. And I do now. This, this is guy, my van. This guy has it's got, got a, a van. dent in this. A, according to the seller, this is a. ran into a child's. a, a 12 year old child here. Should we add this in? Is it a bit. I, I didn't do incriminating? it. Incriminating? I don't know. Apparently he rung the police though. He was, he's like an honest oh, guy. Oh, what happened to the kid? Ran off. It's like. <laughs> donk! Yeah, apparently. <laughs> We are going to, we're about to launch our new flat pack van furniture, which would be fun to get you down. Slam this thing, build it out for me, like the way I'd want to build a van out. And um, haven't done that for a long time. And um, show you the new conversions as well, which are pretty much the same as the old ones, but new material, a few more refinements, etc. We were going to try and bosh this whole thing out in one day, but we know that actually it was going to take a bit longer. So we've already cheated and we've put the suspension on the front. Hilariously, that's wound all the way up. That's full, that's the highest that skid can go. That's stupid. But we haven't done the rear, because it's just like a drift bus. <laughs> Sick. I'm gonna do a T6 front end on this. As much as I love this. Um, yeah, we're just gonna make it look a bit more modern. A pair of stitches and steel, 18 inch steel wheels that will go on in black. Lower the back. And then obviously wheels at the back. We might put some spaces on to make it a bit of a stancy boy. Um, and then the cool thing about the barn doors is the barn doors on these vans haven't changed since 2004. So we'll, um, we've got a set of more modern tail lights and a fresher bumper because this one's a bit tired. Can I have these? They're yours. Oh, let's go! One, we've also cheated and we've lined the inside already. Um, and this is, this thermal stuff is really good and this shit is pretty... I'm not sure where I'm at with lining vans, but um, yeah, it takes a bit of noise out and yeah, kind of like the noise thing more than anything. I'm getting old. We've got loads of the, the rigging has changed slightly and we've sort of pissed this fan we've used as like a demo to piss around with that as well. It's been quite fun. And then, oh, what? You're a badass, Remy. Oh, yes. Oh, what's that? You imagine just being like cruising around a van and just finding a carrot and just be like, get parked. I found a carrot. This took a bit of finding actually. A Lupo 3L. I saw this as it came in, man. Steering wheel. Got a bit shafted actually. Bought it from Germany and um, cost a lot of money to import. Yeah. And they're not cheap anymore. We used to buy these for 100 quid and then everybody started buying them too. And they're not 100 quid anymore. And that'll be that. We're just gonna, it's a Friday, Christmas is around the corner and we're just gonna have a nice day pissing around with the Spanners. Should be really good. Good one. Come on, let's go! What am I explaining? You're explaining that the rear doodah sway bar. Yeah, if you jack up one side to do the rear, the roll bar will hold everything up funny. So if you jack up both, then both the wheels will drop and you can get the springs out easier. There but luckily, we, we use... we've got the tool for that shot. <laughs> Lifting devices. Fuck <laughs> off! <laughs> 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 
Yeah. Are we are good? good? That's how Volkswagen could build them. <laughs> you say banana and I'll be heavy. Yeah, original spring. spring nice and rusty. Assembly here. This is our new spring. Is this a progressive rate spring or is this a. Uh, that's probably progressive, it's thinner at the top, but, but that's the same. That's what's happening here. Make it like. Well, that's over 50 cookies warm, mate. Right? That's all I've got to say. This is quite nice, ready? This is a bit of a purchase, actually. T6.1 bed. Is it brand new? Brand new. How do you get in the back? Oh, hang on. Oh, you put your step down. You just step in there. Clam run up. Yeah. Sick. Yeah, just was, someone was like, you need to buy this, look what's up for sale. And I was like, you're right, we do need to buy that. <laughs> Man, he's taken a few wheels off in his time. The foot jam. The foot jam. It's freaking low. Need some wind. Yeah, that's good though, man. I think it's good. Next step. We are going to do the back interior. Woohoo! Nothing beats an empty panel van, huh? Insulated van. Mm, side panel kit. Push these little boys into the holes. What's this? What's this made of? Recycled plastic. Oh, no way. Yeah, strong, waterproof, light. We got too excited with the lowering of the vehicle and decided to uh, drop it, but actually we put it back on jack stands because he's about to tear the front off and do a conversion. Uh, T6 facelift. Um, me and kickflip, do a kickflip. And uh, me and Josh are going to install the false floor module. Sick. And these are pretty similar to the old ones, but we've had a bit of a change of heart with the material we use. And also, as you can see, it's quite small now. Yeah. It's pretty much pallet shippable. So rather than us installing them now, it's going to be like a IKEA flat packed fan furniture. Yeah, sick. Man. What are they made of? What is this? This is it's, that, that's probably the most exciting bit, actually. Um, it's marine waste that is so ugly that it can't be recycled. It's plastic, fishing nets, marine litter that is heated up, smashed together, and then we put this texture on the top of it so you've got that grip and that hard wearing surface on the top um, for the thicker stuff. So you use two different materials. You've got a 19 mil and a 13 mil. The 13 mil is the floor and the and the um, a few other bits that aren't so strength based, and then the Verticals on the top sheet is the, the 19. And with the 19, we put this um, texture on it. Yeah, and yeah, nice. freaking lightweight, very waterproof, pretty strong. This marches a bit more to our beat as we're moving forward. Ethically and physically and weight and water and hard wearing and sort of list was too long to, to sort of ignore it. So um, yeah, here we are.
no more dent here. No, no more child's heads <laughs> for the time being. Yeah. Um, we pretty much got there. There's still a steering wheel over here. That didn't quite make it on. The front end isn't quite attached and honed properly yet, but it's there. Um, we're pretty happy with the ride height. Um, front could come down a bit maybe. Um, we've got some new seat covers that we've stuck in here, but then the heavy lifting was done in the back with the conversion. But, um, yeah, it's a big day. It's now dark. We're all ready to go home. But um, yeah, it's cool. What do you reckon? Yeah, man, I like it. I like the, um, the new material. definitely a, a win for me, I think. Yeah. And yeah, just to clean, clean up a bit, it's great. So this is your new daily van? Yeah, this is going to be me. So quite selfishly, I'm pretty happy. Just like a little bit of a, um, like a, a tradey sort of stealthy, um, stealthy panel van that most people wouldn't really know what was different to it, but. <gasps> hey. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, f we'll, we'll get it finished and we'll send you some photos. Yeah, nice. Pretty. Hmm. Uh, oh, is it time to go home? Let's do it. Let's do it.